Hollywood Mafia. Hello, Internet. Welcome to another episode of Jesse's Corner. There's an extended version of the thing I just did. Uh, it's supposed to have two more characters, so I wanted to do another video. But while looking for the video, someone posted a video of it already with the characters' names in the title and them in the thumbnail. So I already know. Whatever. I'm already set up. <laughs> Let's just do this. I'm still excited to see more gameplay. Yep, yep. Still the weird Mega Man Asgard. What if all the levels are going to be mashups? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Apparently, they've said that it's going to be uh, more freeform. Ooh! Ooh! Cool. Is this too loud? Yeah, that makes sense. What's hers gonna be? Oh, it's the binary thing. I guess we already saw this in the last one a little bit. Okay, here we go. Huh. Are we seeing another stone? Are we? Huh. The time zone does the sorely thing in the background, too. I haven't noticed that before. Only two characters and two stones? Now we're working on anything else. Okay. Well, that was cool. Uh, I'm glad to see Cap's design looks a little weird. Let's uh, let's take another look at that. Okay, so it's based off uh, his not his most recent comic book appearance, but before he turned old again, uh, and before he got young again. Shortly after his movies came out, he looked he had a design similar to this. It also kind of looks like his ultimate costume. They got the gray thing in there. I wasn't reading Captain America comics at the time when he was sporting this look, so I can't comment if it's 100% that, but it looked, it's definitely more influenced from the movies, which I think a lot of the Marvel characters probably were. The fact that the items in this game are called Infinity Stones and not Gems is pretty evident, and the lack of X-Men characters, is evident that this is going to be more based on the movie universe than on the comic book universe, although I'm sure it will be... Mostly a blend of the two, much like this is a blend of Capcom and Marvel. Ooh, full circle. <clears throat> and Morgan looks cool. I mean, they didn't really change her design much. She just looks kind of anime realistic-ish, the look they've been going for in this game, I guess. Yeah. Okay. That's that. Uh, bye.